And here is a shocker. Those arcade games with a hanging claw. You see it right there. The ones where your kids will spend 10 bucks to snag a 50 cent prize, but it always seems to slip away. Well, it turns out they are rigged. Can you believe it? No. <laughs> ABC's Nick Watt has the new evidence. As a lifelong player, this news hit me like a ton of lead. The claw is not a game of skill. The arcade owners apparently fix it, so the claw is too weak to win 11 out of 12 grabs. Stand aside, Brian Ross. I'll handle this one. Santa Monica Pier, 3 p.m., and that's my partner, Milo, my little boy. Because basically, this is kiddie gambling. We have more. We do. <laughs> 11 times out of 12, that claw is as limp as a Frenchman's handshake. They're taking candy from babies. I hope we do it. But they're not doing anything wrong. The state of California mandates that just one in 12 times the claw must be strong enough to pick up a prize. Could be worse over in Nevada. It's just one in 15. The claw. I have been chosen. That, thank you, Toy Story, is a rare occurrence. Gotcha. The house always wins. We'll win something else, don't worry. We'll win something else. Oh, yeah. 25 bucks later. There we go. All right, hit the button, move. And we won a two-bit bear. <laughs> <laughs> well done. For Good Morning America, Nick Watt, ABC News, Santa Monica. Oh, have we been there? Yeah, Nick is going to have to work overtime to pay for that. <laughs>